Hello everyone, and how is it going? Uh, I'm starting a new series, as you can see. Uh, it's a Yu-Gi-Oh! series. So, I thought it would be fun to uh, play Yu-Gi-Oh! as well, since I play Hearthstone. And there's this awesome website that you can do Yu-Gi-Oh! dueling if you're into that. If you are, good for you. You have my approval. My thumbs up. Um, so this website that does this um it's a flash flash website so you just need a browser with adobe flash player on it unfortunately you can't do it on mobile yet i don't know if they're planning on doing it on mobile which i kind of want them to do because i'd like to play this on my ipod and stuff so yeah so I'm just working with the deck here. Um, uh, so, let's just find a duel. And hopefully, the person I choose doesn't use pendulums, because I don't like pendulums. Because it just is too overpowered when you don't have pendulums. So, actually, you know what? I'll just make my own. Uh, just go no pens. Oops, that's not what I meant to do. Um, I believe you can see my mouse. I don't know if I can or not, but yeah. Um, mm, eh, traditional. Uh, yes, none of these, can, it doesn't contain anything bad. That was just saying that the dual note doesn't contain anything, like, bad, you know, just like anything in general. Uh, so, you start out doing rock, paper, scissors, see who gets to choose who goes first and second. Oh, darn it, I'm going first. You could tell that I'm going first because the first had a red around it, and as you can see, my little uh, thing is red. So, I go first. So, I'm going to, uh, going to normal summon him. And, uh, I'm not going to put down Mirror Force yet, because then he could pop it with something, which... Most people would do. So as you can see, it's not it's not as well um, as well. Uh, what you might call it? Programmed, I guess you could say, like Hearthstone. But it's the best that I that I've played and seen or heard of. However, if you do know a place that's better, comment down below and let me know because I would I'm totally down for that. All right. So this is so on this it does have the phases and whatnot to to uh um to regulate stuff like you've got to you got to go into battle phase before you can before you can attack and then you got to go to end phase before you can end your turn and if it'll show my deck uh, there we go okay now I can grab where is it there's my other giant rat. Okay, special summoning attack. Boop. And it shuffles every time you look at your deck. Which is okay, but I don't know how well shuffled it is and whatnot. That's that's kind of my big deal with it. I got penguin soldier. Uh. Uh, I'm gonna set that. I'm going to do that. 
then going to overlay and overlay attack battle phase and you will just attack whatever monster is there if there is only one monster however if there's more than one monster in your opponent's field then you click click attack then you gotta click which one you want to attack what what was he putting in the, the defense for I may be clicking the wrong thing what what is he doing what is he doing it's a normal monster Um, it is not his turn. What is this guy thinking? Was he thinking? What in the crap? That's also the other thing about this game, or this base, is that you can't tell what's going on. Uh, hacker. Um. No, that's too mean. Um, can't do that. Not your turn yeah what was the guy even thinking he must be a noob I don't know I'll try something that's uh, wait forget to put no pens because I hate pens so let's see if we can get a better person. This guy seems okay, I guess. I don't know what the 105 is. It's, I have no idea. Oh. Come on, please click first. Nope, I'm going first. I like to go second myself, because that's what I like. That's what works for me. Now this ain't too bad of a hand to go first. Uh, that that. Um, deactivate that. Don't that. And in my turn. So now he can't attack for three of his turns. That's what swords is. And when I place it down, all oh, his face down monsters are flipped face up. But since uh, he had no monsters, then it wasn't even worth it. There wasn't anything to do. I'm just gonna set that. I don't really care right now. Mm, I'm going to activate this. Send this to graveyard, and I'm gonna choose that one. What was it? Photon lead. Summon one special hand and face up attack. Okay, I have no idea why you placed that down, but. Okay, I'm just gonna attack him. Yay! <laughs> Come on, give me another monster. This is turn two. <laughs> That's the other thing about swords, is you gotta keep track of it. Otherwise, then you're all confused and whatnot. What? The defense? Why? Um, if this card attacks you... Okay, yes. Okay. The defense. Right. I forgot about that effect. I forgot about that effect. Oh, goody. Honest. 
And what is this? Trans modify. Send so one face up monster you control the graveyard, especially summon one from your deck. Uh, from your deck, one monster with the same type and attribute as the monster in the graveyard, but one level higher. It's a level 5 special summoned monster to control. Cannot be destroyed by card effects. This card was special summoned by monster to monsters control. Gain 300. Oh, and he is... a mustang. Great. Yeah. Alright, yeah. Go to grave, but I don't take any damage since he was in defense. I'm just going to activate this. Hmm? Oh. Oh, darn. Whatever. I'll just end my turn. I still have heartfelt appeal. Mm, I guess Photon Lady is a good spell. Activate. I'm going to choose that one. And 20,000. Oh, right, 300. Um, oh, well, fine then. That means that I lose another 19. Well, this stinks. Ha 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 ha. Normal summon. Activate. He's now at, um, 2,300. So I'm going to attack him. Definitely. Oh wait, no. Eh, oh well. I could have dealt him more damage, but I realized now that. Uh... Oh crap. the grave. I take 500. And then that was at 8, no, 300, no. Uh, plus 19. There we go. I forget that it targets, darn it all. I'm just going to set that. I'm pretty much screwed for this battle. This is my own deck that I'm running, so just go to grave and take another 19. Yep, and I lose. Yeah, quit that. Don't really want to rematch with him. How much time we got on here? 14 minutes. We'll do another battle. Okay, we'll go... No, wait, we need to select my right deck here. Actually, let's work this deck. This one's got uh, armored dragons added into it. Think about this website, you can have any cards 
you know of in your deck. So whether it be Exodia or uh, the God cards, you can add any of them as long as they're on the record. Yeah, we're just going to host again. As usual, no pens. Wait, hold on a second. I gotta check and make sure of something. Uh, I will be right back. Okay, I think I'm back. Yes, I'm back. Okay. So, uh, let's see. Host another duel. No pens, as usual. For me, because they're a piece of crap. <sighs> and I hate him. It just basically it just a like a beat stick way. I don't know how to explain it. It's just so people can win more. So idiots without strategy you can just go like oh pendulum summon pendulum summon and then well can't do it, nothing. Let's get pendulums. Which I don't like running a pendulum. Not yet, at least. Ah, eat it. Now I actually get to go second this time. Me. Alright. Oh boy. Interesting starting hand. Okay, sets one. Sets two. Oh, you know what I realize? Ah, oh, crap. I realize that uh, I'm just working my default deck. I didn't change it to my actual dragon. Oh crap! Um. Okay. If this card is attacked, or either you can pay uh, once per battle. This card gains three thousand attack during that damage calculation only. Holy crap! If it is attack is it attacks or is attacked. So basically my only hope is uh destroy it by card effect. But I guess if it attacks me I can use this on it. I'm just going to activate this first and do it on that one. What is it? Um once you put Instead of you, your opponent takes battle damage. Oh, yes. Put that back to grave. Um, this one has more defense. I'm just going to put that out there. And then face. Since I'm going to be adding that stuff to my... Uh, Okay. Fine by me. Oh, ho, ho, ho. That will be useful next turn. I'm going to set down this well. And then my turn. Then we're going to go activate. To graveyard. And on to you. That's how you get rid of a card. That's very annoying. What is this? Shin takes damage from the card effect. Uh, Dark Room the Nightmare and Flick. Oh. Okay, so I take a 1,100. Well, that's a kind of cool combo for him. You, oh, wow. He's got a lot of set cards now. Um, 
going to uh, fix him. What is this? Change him to defense position. Okay. Oop, nope, that's not what I meant. Uh, special defense. There we go. Do defense. There we go. And then we're just going to normal swing. Yep. And I guess that's got to go to defense too. What is this? 800, so I take another 1,100. This dude's kind of got cool setup, I guess. What is this? Uh, life points for each monster on your opponent's side of the field, so I take... You now, gosh. This dude has just like a damage deck, basically. Set that. Overlay. Um, overlay with that one. And I can attack you. XYZs are ranks, not levels. That's the workaround on that. Okay, I'm waiting. What am I waiting for? Come on, what am I waiting for? Yeah, see? And then I want my turn. Since he's got to be in defense. Yes, you are, especially since I'm going to activate this and target him on Utopia. And battle phase, attack directly. That's 3,500 to you. Yeah, okay. Yeah, he's pretty much screwed. Because his strategy is just to, like, as just to keep them, keep your opponent um, stuck in defense so you can't attack and then just deal damage to them. I take another 1,100 then. Is most likely it, and he says 1,100, so. Yeah, he's screwed. Nightmare Wheel. One monster your opponent controls cannot take it. When it leaves the field, destroy this card each time you inflict uh, that monster must remain on the field to activate and resolve this effect. Okay. Well, that goes to grave anyway. Mm. 
Wait, no, 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 oh, darn. Let's see. Okay, each standby phase, so I take another 500, or 800, because of the dark room. What you gonna do now? Gonna end? Cause I can still end him. It'll just take a couple of turns. What is this? For each card in their hand and for each card they control. Fifteen. And after my standby face I'm done for. He just screwed me over with Nightmare Wheel. And I take another eight hundred. Nice. Nice going with that night mare wheel. <laughs> Heart of the card. <laughs> uh, I'm in defeat. I'm about a rematch. No, we left. Darn it all. But I'm my wheels. Wheels not that bad. This the setup that he's got. That was. I was kind of wicked. I was just like, oh boy, this dude's gonna defeat me so bad. Anyway, thanks for watching. Um, if you like me playing this uh, and you want to see more of it, um, then go ahead and click the like button down below. And if you know another place that has a dueling setup for Yu-Gi-Oh! that looks better and works better than this, post it down in the comments. Because I would really like to play it because this is kind of a bad way because... People can do whatever they want, and nobody can stop them. I mean, I mean, you could just quit, of course, but then that that's not fun. It's it's not like Hearthstone where you can't, where it says you can't do this or that. So anyway, if you want to post that down below, that'd be great, because this thing ain't the best. And I will see you in the next video. Bye-bye.